Hey, yo, look, man. Let's go ahead and just dive right on into it and cut straight to the chase. You see the title, my nigga. You see the title. <clears throat> you see the title, my nigga. Listen, some of y'all, man, some of y'all do not even want. Some of y'all. <sighs> shit, a lot of y'all, bro, don't even want pussy, bro. Some of y'all don't even want pussy, bro. Some of y'all don't even want sex. Some of y'all don't even want lust, bro. The shit that y'all be seeing on porn. You know, some of y'all don't want to do nasty shit and freaky shit. Some of y'all don't want to uh, just grab somebody from the butt and just do them. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all don't want to... Uh, uh, be a, do missionary, be on the front, and and, and 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 just have sex, and then or have a girl make you make you bust. Some of y'all don't. Some of y'all. Some of y'all do not even really want that deep down, bro. You know what I'm saying? And I literally just said this shit to myself. That's why I had to pull this camera out right now and make this video, bro. Cause this is a real. This is the truth, bro. You think, my nigga, that you want pussy, uh, sex, you know, to have some fun, bro, bro, a lot of y'all, man, a lot of y'all guys, bro, a lot of y'all guys and women, this is not, this is not, I'm not excluding the women on this subject and this topic, all right, I'm not excluding them, I'm not excluding y'all either, some of y'all men and some of y'all females out here and women out here, right, only uh, y'all don't deep down inside want sex. Y'all don't want what y'all think y'all want. I just want to have sex. No, oh, I just want, I'm just trying to fuck. I'm just trying to uh. I'm just trying to uh. Bro, listen, bro. A lot of y'all, bro, deep down and within your your heart and your soul, bro, you just want love, bro. That's all you really want, bro. That's all you really want. Now, what do I mean by this, bro? I mean it exactly how I just said it. Some of y'all literally just want love. And it's sad. You want to know why I say that? Because, you know, you want to know why it's sad, bro? Why it's a sad thing? It's sad because you shouldn't be feeling like that. You shouldn't feel like... You shouldn't feel eager to want to have sex with somebody or eager to want to get down and dirty with somebody. You know? Um, or you shouldn't feel lack of love right now, bro. Nobody on this planet should feel lack of love. But I'm telling you now, that is what you really want. And when I say love, I don't just mean, uh, I don't just mean like, like sexual, like love when you kissing on each other, romantic love. That's one of the, the loves that I mean though, but that's not the only one I mean. Just love in general, like someone to feel you, someone to under, understand you. That's all you want. A lot of y'all want intimacy. A lot of y'all want intimacy, huh? You think you want sex. A lot of y'all think y'all want sex. But that's not really what y'all want, bro. Alright? That's not really what y'all want. You think you want sex. You think you want this and that. No, bro. You just want intimacy. You want to be close with somebody and you want to be trusted. Like, you want to feel like that person can trust you and you can trust that person. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want to feel comfortable. You want to be vulnerable. It's not about sex. You know it's not. When y'all fucking, y'all vulnerable. But right after y'all fuck, right after you nut, nigga, right after you nut, nigga, what is you doing? Be real, bro. Don't lie. Yeah, right then and there, you might still laugh and giggle with the girl just because you don't want to hurt shawty feelings. But you know damn well, you know damn well that you it's, it's awkward. You know, you might, you might, you might laugh and get, but you don't really feel a connection. If all y'all did was fuck, y'all ain't talk to each other, look each other in the eyes. You know what I'm saying? Talk to each other with them low voices and just, yeah, what's good, babe? I mean, how you feeling? Shit, I mean, when I look at you, it's just like, damn. I don't, you know, like, you, 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 y'all just, y'all just like, boom, boom, boom. Bust the you know, and nut, and then after your nut, you know, 
you know damn well you're just you're just tireless after that. You just lost your you just gave up. First of all, I taught y'all the time on seeing retention. You just gave up your sexual energy, bro. You just gave up your seed. You know, you just gave up your seed, bro, for a woman that didn't touch you deep down within your soul, bro. You see what I'm saying? Like, and when I say give up your seed, like I mean it in all ways, bro. Like, man, how can I put this? Like, like I'm not. Listen, this is my opinion. I don't give a fuck who give a fuck. Got a problem with my opinion? My opinion. You. You, if you get, listen, if you do, first of all, you shouldn't really be releasing your seed like that. But if you do, if you was a person and you did a good job, you you hold, you held your seed for maybe a good, like, 90 days, 100 days, and, you know, four or five months. I mean, shoot, you know, and you still may not have met your soulmate or your lover yet, but you ain't busted a nut in four or five months. I mean, dude, you already put in a lot of good work. Go ahead and bust a nut. I'm not condoning it. I'm not saying that it, that go watch porn. That's not what I mean. I'm saying... You know, if you want to do something, you know, but be smart about the person you are messing with, bro. Like, don't just have sex with just a random person just because you want a nut. That's so, f bro, that is the most stupidest mess ever, bro. A lot of y'all out here just literally just have sex because you want a nut. Yeah, like, side note, like, if you, if you bust, if you bust and you let your seed everything, you let your seed go because you want a nut. Because you just want a nut, you tripping. Like, if you ain't even held your nut for like a week, and you just want a nut, and you just want a you want a nut because you want one, then you tripping. All right, that's that's you know that's different. Now, if you need a nut, if you need a nut, that's different. You see, wants and needs are different. If you want something, you know, you still have discipline to know that okay, I can't. I'm not going to do that to go get what I want. I'm going to get it in another type of way. You see what I'm saying? Whereas if you need something, though, you're going to make it happen, period. So it's like, you know, you you want a nut, then you tripping. But if you need a nut, you've been holding your seat for four to five months. You know what I'm saying? You still ain't ran into your soulmate. I mean, nut, nigga, you need the nut. You have to release. See, like I said, it's balanced down here. It's this duality. So just like you, 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 you know, you should not be indulging into all that type of stuff, and you should not, and, and men, us men, should not be releasing on a consistent basis. Us men do have to release, though. You see what I'm saying to you? We still do have to release. We still have to produce. We still have to make babies. You know what I'm saying? Um, we have this. We have a penis for a reason. You see what I'm saying? Everything is for a reason. You have to have balance, though. So if you need a nut, that's a different story, cuz. You know what I'm saying? If you need a nut, by all means, release. And I'm not saying watch porn. I'm saying go, go, go do something. Go, you know, do, be creative. You know, I can't tell you what the, you know, you got to use your brain and see how you about to get your nut off. But, you know, that's if you need one. You know what I'm saying? You got to sometimes release all that energy that you've been building up from holding your nut, cuz it gets deep. Y'all, I ain't going to ramble too much on this audio, but yeah, if you need a nut, do what you got to do. But if you want one, if you if you ain't been holding your seat for only a couple of days and you just want you just want a nut, you just want to feel a pleasure, you're not using your brain because you don't need that nut. You want it. Wants and needs is a difference. But back to the video. Nah, bro. If you if you doing that because you just want a nut, that's not cool. It's like you should you might as well. You supposed to have fun with it. If you if you held your seed for 90 days straight and you need a nut, you want you know like I need a release, bro. I ain't been watching porn. I've been going a little bit extra hard on myself. I ain't been watching porn. I don't watch porn ever. I don't watch porn anymore. You know what I'm saying? I I ain't been watching porn. I ain't been uh um hitting on girls or giving no girls my attention. Like I ain't been all into or I ain't been hitting on guys, hitting on, that I, like when you're in that mindset Sometimes you still need to get you need to pleasure yourself though, right? And maybe the universe has not aligned you, it's not on your timeline time for you to meet your soulmate yet, right? Okay, boom. But it might be another person over here that you can get intimate with. You see what I'm saying? She might not want a relationship. He might not want a relationship. But if y'all can connect with each other on a spiritual level to some extent, that's better to get your nut from her or or shorty. For you to get, you know, a guy to, 
Damn, see, dang, and I can't even say that with the girls, man. I can't. It's like it's like it's different because with the women, I can't. Like I really don't condone you letting any guy just stick his dick inside of you. I really don't. I really don't. Cause any, cause right when that dick go in you, energy is going in you, right? Now, 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 if you guys are being intimate with each other and y'all are on a good level, then I, I mean, that's different. But to an extent. You're still getting whatever energy that that guy obtains inside of your vagina. All right. Now, that same thing goes for the guy. The guy's getting all the energy, too. So my bottom line in this video, man, be smart about who you having sex with. But that's sex. And that's crazy how I really just spent like two to three minutes off subject talking about the sex side of this video. <laughs> Listen. Listen. You... How can I put this? You, um, you, a lot of y'all don't even really want the sex. A lot of y'all don't even want to nut, though. That's the thing. A lot of y'all don't even want to nut. A lot of y'all women, a lot of y'all women don't want that. Oh, pleasure. I mean, like, a lot, I mean, we all do. Like, of course, it's in our nature to want to have that orgasm. But I'm saying, on a normal consistent basis though we ain't thinking about nut you should not be worried about giving your you should not be worried about busting a nut or you should not be worried about having a having a nigga pipe you down pipe your guts in every day of the week also you shouldn't be worried about it you know like every fucking you should not be worried, you, bro. I'm not gonna sit here and tell you how much and how often you should be thinking about sex, but what I'm trying to say is, a lot of people out here think it's the sex. Oh, I be fucking da da da. I do this da da. Nah, bro. All you really want is a hug, bro. A lot of y'all, all you really just want is somebody to hug on you, look you in your your eyes and kiss you and, and make you feel good about yourself, bro. That's literally that's all you really want. You want to be healed, bro. A lot of y'all just want to be healed, bro. Because when y'all was kids, your parents didn't give you the love that you were supposed to have, bro. They didn't give you the intimacy that you were supposed to have, bro. A lot of y'all. And it may not have been the parents, but when your childhood your childhood years, though, you may not even remember what happened in your childhood years, bro. A lot of y'all could have forgot about whatever happened when you was like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. A lot of y'all could have forgot and you could have not even known that you were you were not given enough love as a kid, as a baby, as a little little kid, a little little boy, little girl. A lot of y'all just did not receive the love that y'all were supposed to receive. So that makes your subconscious feel like you need love. So you seek validation out here. You seek sex and all this other stuff, thinking that that's thinking that that's going to bring anything to you. Then you're wondering why you having sex after sex after sex after sex and why you still trying to fuck and why you still ain't happy yet. But all it takes is that one, that one session with a woman, right? That one link up with a woman, that one date with a woman, that one date with that guy, that one date with that handsome man or whatever to you that you are like. Y'all actually look each other in the eye. Y'all actually connect with each other. Y'all actually... Y'all actually heal each other. Y'all actually share energy with each other. Y'all actually reciprocate energy with each other. You see what I'm saying? Y'all reciprocate energy with each other. Because if you know, then you know. All that's going on around the world right now is people is just energy fighting for each other. Fighting for each other's energy, bro. Energy warring out here, bro. Energy battling. You can tell, bro. If you read energy, you know what I'm talking about. Folks out here, when one person says something, the other person is going to say something to try to step over that person. And then this person is going to go back and try to say... It's energy snatching out here. A lot of y'all are tired. A lot of y'all are restless. A lot of y'all are like, damn, bro, I'm tired of... Everywhere y'all go out in the public or in your house or whatever, bro, you're just tired. You're like, nah, bro. Like, everywhere I go, I got to fucking fight for my energy, fight for my peace, fight for my whatever, my dignity, my pride, right? 
you you want to be able to just be in a room alone with a woman or with a guy and to just be vulnerable in that person's energy. No, you want to be able to know that you can sit back like this and not feel like they're going to try to do something to you or or say something to you or throw you off your energy, your vibe. You want to be able to relax and not feel picked at. That's all you want, bro. You want love, bro. You want her, you want that woman to 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 look at you and say I'm riding for you and really sincerely mean it. Bro, that's all. So with that being said, just take your attention away. Stop indulging in all to this sexual stuff, toxicity stuff, not like nonstop. And and you know, understand that you know all you really want bro is love that's what you really want and when you stay inside of your divine alignment and you stay in your true nature of yourself and just be yourself you know and don't indulge in the shit you know you're not supposed to be indulging in you know and i'm not saying you know that y'all can't have sex bro that's not what i'm saying i'm saying that you need to make sure that everything you do, you do it because you want to do it. You need to do it because it feels good to you. Not because, oh, I'm having sex because I just want a nut. But after this nut, I'm st- I'm not going to, you know what I'm saying? Like, nah, bro, that's not cool. Have sex because you're in the mood to have sex. And you're, this is in, it's exciting to you. Not because it's. Oh, I just need a nut. I'm just saying, y'all. See y'all in the next video, though. I'm gone.